Each year, the Missouri Department of Conservation provides a highly anticipated draw hunt program for the diehard duck hunter on 15 conservation areas spread across the state. Today, I'll join Mike Checkett and his longtime hunting partner, Mark Shoup, as they introduce me to their old stomping grounds in pursuit of the king of the ducks and this historical migration corridor. You know, a lot of your success at Grand Pass is determined by your luck in the draw. You get in the line and you draw for priority of pick, and obviously some areas are better than other areas. The chances are often slim. They were turning anywhere from four to 10 parties away the week before we got up here. We had 78 hunters harvested 279 ducks for a 3.58 bird per hunter average. Every morning we have a daily drawing. People come in, take a chance of trying to get in for 10 positions or maybe 50 parties vying for those 10 positions. Reach in and grab one. And don't grab number one, because we'll be dead. 41, that isn't good. Going into the draw, you're always a little nervous whether you're gonna make it out or not. And boy, when Worth reached in that box and pulled pill 41 out, it was kind of, uh, we're gonna be right on the edge of whether we make it or not. <laughs> we're in by like one. <laughs> <laughs> Duck hunters are an optimistic bunch. I really thought even though we were last party into a pool, one of the last parties into the whole area, uh, we were in a spot that wasn't exactly where we wanted to go. But uh, you know, it looked nice and I, I thought there's enough birds around we were gonna have a good hunt. <laughs> yeah, can kill a duck, can you? My optimism was still high. I've had some super hunts where I was the last person to leave the building. Literally, Mark and I have hunted that exact same spot before in the past. We've had some outstanding hunts in that exact same pool. Here's a signal. Mark! In the early dawn of day two, Mike, Mark Shoup, and I attempt to draw a lower pill in hope of setting out to a hotter spot here on Grand Pass. Feeling lucky, Mike decides to draw. A low draw almost always presents the opportunity for a better pool, presenting abundant opportunities. A high draw, however, could force us to make alternative plans even before the sun rises. To determine who was gonna have the best draw, and I said, Mike, you know, I don't want that pressure this morning, you go pick. The day before, we were one of the last parties to pull, so this time we, we got up front. We were probably third or fourth in. I dreamt pulling that low pill, and it happened. When he pulled that number eight pill, we were going to have a good hunt. There's your chance. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's pretty. Very nice. Very, very nice. 